Yevgeny Prigozhin, the Russian mercenary leader, was buried in St. Petersburg on Tuesday, six days after the unexplained private jet crash that is believed to have killed him. And secrecy surrounding the arrangements for the closed funeral meant it could not be turned into a large-scale show of support for the man whose massive mutiny in June amounted to the largest ever threat to President Vladimir Putin's rule. Putin did not attend the ceremony, according to the Kremlin. Reuters cameras briefly captured this footage from the cemetery, which was under heavy security, before two unidentified mourners ordered them to stop recording. Russian authorities have not said why the plane crashed, and the Kremlin has rejected speculation that Putin ordered Prigozhin's death over the mutiny as a, quote, absolute lie. Villagers living near the crash site told Reuters at the time that they heard a loud bang before seeing the plane fall. The plane model had a good safety record and only one incident in two decades of flying, which was not related to mechanical issues. This is the last known video of Prigozhin, said to have been filmed in Africa and released just days before the incident. The crash killed him and other top members of his private military company, Wagner Group, along with the plane's crew. It's not clear what will happen to the group now, which appears to be leaderless.